Yes, Bill, uh, I guess uh, you might say I kind of live out of a suitcase about six months of the year, and my wife thinks I'm never home, but uh, uh, of course, uh, the recruiting is uh, part of my, mainly my job, I think at VMI, along with coaching the freshman team or the rap team. And uh, the recruiting angle, it, it takes a lot of time and, of course, takes a lot of effort and a lot of travel, you know, to try to get a good basketball club together. Where do you do most of your recruiting for VMI? Well, we uh, actually in the past, uh, before I came to VMI, they did a lot of recruiting in Indiana, and so we continued this and do some in, in, in Indiana and also in Ohio. Uh, I do a great deal of recruiting in Ohio, particularly because I was familiar with uh, a lot of this area, having gone to Marshall University down in Huntington, West Virginia, and playing uh, uh, teams in the Mid-American Commerce throughout Ohio. I knew a lot of this area, plus uh, Kentucky. We, uh, in fact, we have two boys on this year's team from Kentucky, and we hope to get some more because uh, they play real fine basketball there, as you know, and uh, this helps out uh, having boys like we have there to help our future recruiting. So these are mainly the areas. Plus, uh, we go into New York and New Jersey area, uh, Virginia particularly. Of course, we're always going to Virginia. In fact, this year we're trying to get some boys uh, in Virginia because we feel like there's a lot of good prospects this year in Virginia, and we hope that uh, we might sway a few of them to become VMI. Up to this point, how does... Virginia, the Virginia caliber play compared with that with that of other parts of the country. Well, I think it's on the it's in the uh, number of teams that are better ball clubs now has increased uh, in the past few years. Uh, I know when I came to Virginia in 1962, I didn't think the caliber of basketball then was what it is, for instance, in Kentucky, Ohio, and Indiana. Now I think it's getting up there to where it would be competing if they were playing each other. Is there anything that can help Virginia basketball at the high school level? Do you feel that uh, doing away with the classification system might be a step in the right direction? Well, a lot of people think this. Of course, you know Kentucky has this type of system, and uh, uh, some people think this way. Uh, I'm not going to be a critic on it or a pro or con on the thing. Uh, I believe that uh, one thing that can help it is more of the coaches being basketball coaches and not assistant football coaches. It's a big thing. In the past years, uh, or some time ago, this was the case that... Uh, basketball coach was just an assistant football coach who took over basketball in the, in the winter. And now it's getting to where there is a basketball coach assigned. Often, of course, he is sometimes an assistant football coach maybe, but more than likely there is a head football and a head basketball coach at each school. And this coach is uh, an actual basketball player, a former college player, one who's been very much interested in basketball.